Archangel Gabriel, the Angel of the Annunciation. This is regarded as one of the main divine messengers as well as the one who announced the coming of the promised Messiah, the great master the Lord Jesus Christ. Gabriel is not only reported in the scriptures as being a great messenger, but there are also references that this may be the angel of death as he is referred to in some traditions. And the big question is, are you sure you really know the angel Gabriel? Watch this video until the end and be surprised by the story of Archangel Gabriel that you didn't know. But first leave your like, like and share if you are not subscribed, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to activate the notification bell so you don't miss any interesting videos like this. The holy scriptures contained in the Bible describe countless mysteries of humanity, mysteries that go beyond human understanding, and with this many come to doubt due to lack of faith in the Creator's words however it is irrelevant whether or not you believe in the Creator's words. God will always be God regardless of whether we believe in Him or not, and we know that God does not need us but we who depend on Him. In the Bible there are numerous descriptions of angelic beings, where different types are mentioned, as well as their hierarchies, the best known are described as angels, archangels, cherubs and seraphim. However, there are an infinity of beings created by God that we do not know. The word angel means messenger, the one who brings a message, and so among these messengers we have as reference Gabriel the angel of the Annunciation. Gabriel in some traditions is called an archangel in others, as the angel however, this is also mentioned as the angel of mercy of the revenge of revelation and was also known as the angel of death. Gabriel is regarded as a high-ranking angel not only in Jewish and Christian traditions, but also in Islam, the meaning of his name is taken as man of God, emissary of the Lord, divine fortress or messenger of God, and the angel Gabriel is said to be the ruler of the first heaven, though he is also the ruler of heaven. The documents reveal that Gabriel sits on the left side of God, which makes him the second most important and powerful angel immediately after Archangel Michael. Gabriel is a very important angel for humanity. This one watched directly from the presence of the Almighty God, always appearing at decisive moments of the redemption. He is regarded as the messenger who announced the coming of the Messiah, he is also known as the angel who announces the coming of the Day of Judgment. In the Hebrew Bible, he first appears in the book of the prophet Daniel, he presents himself to the prophet in the form of a flying man, on another occasion, Gabriel appears to the prophet Daniel in a terrifying vision, causing the prophet to fall in great fear of its appearance. Gabriel tells Daniel that he fought for 21 days with the demon called Prince of Persia, a very strong creature, needing the help of Archangel Michael to defeat him. Gabriel announces to the prophet Daniel about the coming of the Messiah that would happen almost 500 years ahead. Many years later the angel Gabriel appears to Zechariah in the temple of God, Gabriel said not to be afraid of his presence, because Zechariah would have a son who would be called John, this would be John the Baptist, the one who would prepare the way for the coming of the Messiah Jesus Christ. The angel explained to Zechariah that he was in the presence of Almighty God, but Zechariah doubted the message because he was already old enough to have children, Zechariah was punished harshly by Gabriel because of his unbelief, he would be mute until his son was born. And this is what happened. Six months after speaking with Zacharias, the angel Gabriel appears to the Virgin Mary and asks her not to be afraid of his presence and announces that she will have a son and that he will be conceived by the Holy Spirit fulfilling the prophecy that God would be with us in human flesh. He also tells me that Zacharias' wife Elizabeth was pregnant. Many say that John the Baptist began to be trained by the angel Gabriel when he was still in his mother's womb. Many Christians also believe that Gabriel was the one who announced to the shepherds about the birth of Christ, 
he would have warned Mary and Joseph about Herod's plan of finding the baby Jesus to kill him. The angel Gabriel would have acted for Jesus about his resurrection, and so he is also considered the angel of resurrection. Gabriel would have rolled the stone bell from the tomb of Jesus when he was resurrected and in the year 98 after Christ some letters were discovered in which several commandments of Jesus Christ were discovered, these would have been delivered and written by the angel Gabriel as Christians believed in the early church. Although many do not believe in the existence of angels, even if we do not realize that they roam the entire planet Earth either to help us or to record all our actions, good or bad, everything is being accounted for and on that great day Archangel Gabriel will be the one who will touch the trumpets initiating the judgment of mankind. I would like to know what your opinion on this subject. Leave your comment your opinion is very important to us, if you are not subscribed, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to activate the notification bell, whenever there is a new video you will be warned. A big hug, stay with God and until next time.